Yes, multiple guests can drive the car that you booked on Turo. Welcome back, my channel. Welcome back to the channel, Believe in Yourself. And I thank you guys for tuning in. This series right here is going to be talking about the Turo host tips for beginners. If you're somebody that's looking to get into the platform, this is the series that you want to watch and tune into. I'll be catching you guys on the next video, but make sure you like, comment, definitely subscribe. Peace. Welcome back to the series, man. I got enough FAQ for you frequently asked question. And this one, once again, is coming from the Tarot platform. Can other people drive a car that I booked? Yes. Multiple guests can drive the car that you booked on Turo, as long as they are all approved to drive. The primary driver, whoever booked the car, can add additional drivers with no fees or additional charges. Only the primary driver can request to add drivers. Turo hosts cannot, I repeat, cannot do it for you. We encourage you to request an additional drivers before your trip starts. Though, guests in the U.S. and Canada can request to add a driver while a trip is in progress. To speed up the process, have your additional driver create a Turo account and get approved to drive before you request to add them. All drivers must have a valid driver's license and meet the age requirement for the car you've booked. You can request to add drivers via the Trips tab in the Turo app without additional drivers, charges, or extra costs. So basically that's the answer, man. You can add additional drivers to any trip that you want as long as they are already approved to drive on Turo. Now, I've had a situation, well, not particular to me, one of the guys, one of the people who I do mentor, they had a particular situation wherein their vehicle that they rented, uh, the parents gave it to their child, son or daughter, I'm not sure which one it was, but um, for prom. And they trashed the car, man. I mean, they smoked in it. Uh, the One of the side rear mirrors was, was damaged. There was scratches. It was just a whole bunch of problems. And damn near totaled almost $10,000 in damages when he got the quote from the dealership, which is crazy. You know, when you have something like that happen, man, it's, it's very upsetting because I don't think... I don't, I mean, don't quote me on this. I'm not 100% sure. I'll ask my friend. But I don't think they added them as an additional driver. They just rented the car and gave it to their kids to drive for um, for their prom. Now, he was able to still get the claim done because the people, they had their insurance and things like that. He had to go through Turo and things like that. But in reality... Um, you never want to have that happen. You know, I've had situations where people have asked me to add additional drivers. And the, the thing with this is, you must understand, um, a lot of times when you're adding additional drivers or you're doing this or doing that, if you're not going to be the person to pick up the vehicle, don't be the person to book the vehicle. Because I've had situations... If you believe you can't make it, you won't make it. Because if you believe that you can do it, you will do it. 